In this video, we will take a look at how the revenue recognition system works in fixed price projects in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012. Let me first take you to the project group setup form where we will be defining most of the behavior for the revenue recognition system. Let me quickly create a new project group called demo and I'll say the name is demo for project revenue recognition. Project type is fixed price and since I want to accumulate all the costs on the project in VIP until revenue is recognized, I will choose balance as the account type for hours, expense and item costs. The next thing that I want to specify is the revenue recognition accounting rule. For this demo, we will recognize revenue based on percentage completion and hence we choose completed percentage. If your organization wanted to recognize revenue only at the end of the project when the project is 100% done, then they would choose completed contract. The matching principle here lets me specify what kind of revenue postings do I want on the project. If I want just one posting for the, comp for the entire revenue, then I would choose sales value. But if I wanted the postings to be split between actual cost and the actual profit, then I would choose production plus profit. In this example, let's choose sales value. I have to specify a sales category because that is where the account to which the revenue will be posted will come from. Now that we have specified all the important parameters, let's save this project group and close this form. Let's now create a fixed price project that will use this project group that we just created. I'll say the name of the project as demo. I'll say demo project and the project group is demo. This is what we just created and then I'll pick a contract. I'll say I need a new estimate project for this fixed price project and I'll pick auto amount as the cost template and estimate month as the period code. Now if you have noticed the data that you are seeing in this demo is from the Contoso data set. So if you have already worked with Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 you would recognize that this data is from the Contoso data set. A few notes on the cost template here. So if I go into the cost template details, what this lets us do is configure for each transaction type the categories that we want the revenue recognition system to look at in order to compute the percentage completion. So the cost template that we are using in this demo happens to include all the categories for hours, which means any transaction that comes with any of these categories will actually be considered by the revenue recognition system when it is computing the percentage completion. So let me close this and click OK here. So this creates a new fixed price project for us. Let me put the project in the process and now let's go and forecast for this project. So what I'm going to say here is I am forecasting 100 hours of design work on this project. And then I close this forecast form. The next thing that we do is to define the milestones for this fixed price project. And the place where we do this is in the on account transactions form which can be accessed from the manage tab in the project details page or from the project list page. So I click on on accounts transactions and I say new milestone and the invoiced um, invoicing amount for this milestone will be $10,000. I close this form. Now let's assume that the project has started executing and employees have started entering time. So let's quickly post an hour journal and we'll say that we have completed 10 hours of work on the design and we will just post this journal. 
so the journal is posted now let's fast forward the time and assume that we are at the end of the month when we should be recognizing revenue on this project now before we run the estimate system to recognize the revenue let's understand uh, what should be the expected revenues on this project at this point so let's go back to the forecast that we created so we have forecasted 100 hours of design work now what is the actuals on this project so if we look at the poster transactions on this project we see that there is an actual cost of $450 for the design work that is already being posted to this project if I open this transaction we see that the quantity is 10 hours so which means if we compare this with the forecast of 100 hours we have completed 10% of the planned work on this project now this is what the revenue recognition system is going to do when we run the estimate system it is going to compare the actual cost with the with the forecasted and then compute the percentage completion on the project and it's going to recognize revenue based on the contract value so the contract value for our project is actually ten thousand dollars so ten percent of ten thousand dollars is a thousand dollars and that is what we should see as the recognized revenue when we run the estimate system so let's go ahead and run the estimate system so I come to the manage tab in the project details page or from the list page and I say estimates I say new estimate and I want to estimate for this month so I pick this month and I say I want to use the total budget minus actual method so here total budget actually means the total forecasts and let me pick the forecast model that I want the estimate system to look at and I say OK so the estimate system is now computing the percentage calculation and then it comes up with 10% as the percentage complete now this matches to what we thought should be the percentage completion based on our manual calculation and hence this looks OK if we look at the general tab we see that it says if you were to post this estimate then a thousand dollars will be recognized as the revenue on this project this seems to be right because ten percent of the contract value which is ten thousand dollars is actually thousand dollars so it looks correct now when we post this estimate the estimate gets posted and let's quickly go and run the project statement to see what was the actual revenue recognized by the estimate system when I click uh, calculate we see that thousand dollars is the actual revenue recognized on this project after we posted the estimate this amount is correct now this thousand dollars is against the four hundred and fifty dollars of cost that was posted on the project for the 10 hours of work that we did so the numbers look correct here and this is how the revenue recognition system works to recognize the revenue so what we just saw was a simple example where the revenue recognition system on fixed price projects recognized revenues when we posted the estimate I hope this video has been helpful in making the concepts clear in Microsoft Dynamics AX 2012 projects. Thank you.